Yo, what up? It's your boy, and y'all already know, I got here another Black Ops 2 uh, news update, whatever you call it. Uh, but yeah, as you can see on the screen right here, the third wave, uh, I believe, just came out. Um, it said, uh, whoops, my bad. Um, hold on. It says, uh, third wave unlock, uh, August 27th. Xbox 360 uh, XR drone avatar, uh, Turtle Beach Ear Force X-ray sweepstakes entry, and uh, to visit Treyarch VIP visit uh, sweepstakes entry. Uh, third wave pre-order bonus choose from these ex three exclusives. So these three you can choose. Either you want the Xbox 360 drone avatar, you want the Turtle Beaches, or you want to go actually when a chance to go visit the actual team and actually yell at their face and be like, yo, man, what's the hold up? Yo, what's tuning in? There's going to be any fucking camping. You better step your game up. All that. Uh, mine, if I were to pick, I'll probably pick the Turtle Beaches because, uh, you know, Xbox 360, I don't have one. Uh, they, you know, probably for PS3 is the same thing. I don't, I don't prefer the Avatar, but um, I would like to say the Treyarch, you know, what's up, man, but... That's impossible, man. But you never know. And uh, either of these is, you know, is, is one in a million. But uh, I think a better chance for uh, a regular guy like you and me would probably be like Turtle Beaches or something like that. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's that's the third wave that just came out. And that just came out today, which hopefully I will be uploading this today, either today or tomorrow. But when it... This came out is the uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Care Package and Prestige Edition uh, announced, and I I knew it, people. I knew it. I knew they were gonna announce it. That's why I have I, I haven't pre-ordered. Um, when was that? I think uh, April, I believe. That was available for pre-order, and so much of my friends and so much of my people's deals like, yo, man, pre-order, man, pre-order, man. I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna pre-order, you know what I mean? But oh no, hurry up and all that shit. And then come July, you know, I was like, man, I think I should pre-order it, man. I was on my way to GameStop. But I was like, nah, man, because Black Ops, they had the Prestige Edition. And Modern Warfare 3 had their Hardened Edition. And I knew they was going to have some kind of thing. And today is the day. They announced it. And I knew it, people. And um, I don't know in some of your areas, but uh, in my area, uh, VA, uh, Virginia. You can't, like, uh, change it. Once you go pre-order Black Ops, you're down to buy the regular Black Ops, too. You can't just go, oh, oh, you know that new uh, Prestige Edition? Can I change it to that? No, you can't do that, at least here, because you have to, you know what I mean? They already have a certain thing. If you order Black Ops 2, the regular version, that's what you have to get. Unless you tell one of your cousins or your father, your mother, or whatever... To order that, then, you know, it could be like that, too. But as far as yourself, you can't do it, at least here. I know where you guys live. If you can, a lot of people say you can't. You know, kudos to you, man. But over here, you can't, and I knew it, man. That's why I waited. And I know what you guys are saying, Black Ops. Like, you know, Call of Duty, who cares? But for my people out there, I'm going to give you this uh, uh, information. Hopefully, i give it to you first. But like I said, I ain't your number one source. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, um, let me go to first the, uh, the, what was this called, the Harden Edition, excuse me, but you know, Harden Prestige, same crap, right, hopefully you guys can see right here, you get, of course, the Nuketown 2025, if you pre-order it, uh, you know, link in the description, uh, welcome to Nuketown Zombies, so there's a Nuketown Zombies, and if you're following, uh, Call of Duty on Twitter, you'll see that they release uh, pictures of this a couple, I believe weeks ago or a couple of days ago, exclusive um, Xbox Live Claw Avatar uh, prop and zombie avatar costume, I believe it is the same thing for PS3, uh, limited edition challenge coins, little probably medallion coins, pretty cool, official soundtrack by Jack Wall with theme by uh, Trent. Uh, Resonor, uh, soundtrack of the game, um, maybe it's good, of course, the Collective Steelbook, uh, of course, the game is included, and that's the box set, this is, 
I uh, believe it's seventy nine ninety nine. Of course, U.S. Um, you know, I don't know about the other areas, but yeah, uh, seventy nine ninety nine, eighty dollars, whatever how you want to say it. But yeah, that's that. Um, one hundred seventy nine ninety nine for the care package. This is a new one, I believe, for Call of Duty right here. Uh, you get a huge, huge, huge uh, box set uh, care package. And if you don't know what a care package is, you know, then you, you don't know Call of Duty. But, uh, again, probably the same thing. Nuketown, Nuketown uh, Zombies. And I'm really excited about that, about the Nuketown Zombies. That they include that in the multiplayer and in the Zombies. The exclusive PlayStation 3 system, uh, PS3, excuse me. Or whatever, right? Uh, multiplayer theme and zombie themes. Uh, and I'm getting to that right there. Limited edition challenge coins, same thing. The soundtrack, of course, where the game comes, the steelbook. But out of all is the MO27 Dragonfire drone with remote control. And this one actually seems more better than the actual RCA from Black Ops, which is, again, the Prestige Edition, I believe. But, man, this looks fucking awesome. And um, if you're if you can't wait until Black Ops, if you're really a big fan, if you actually maybe want just this um, drone, Dragonfire drone, as a replica to you know, f you know, this is the one to get, man. I mean, uh, yeah, guys, that's that's about it practically. <laughs> Sorry, um, getting back to my old uh, self, you could say, just came uh, came back a couple of days ago, but. Uh, yeah, guys, um, as you can see on the top, $59.99 for, uh, for, excuse me, for, uh, you know, regular version, $79.99 for the hardened edition, and for the care package, $179.99. So, really, it's going to be amounts so for $60, $80, and $180. Uh, you guys be the judge. Tell me comments below if you guys are going to get any of these. The regular version, the hardened edition, the care package. Please, 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 uh, you know, leave a comment below. Just tell me, you know, what's up? Are you anticipated for it? Are you just fucking tired of Call of Duty like most people are? What's the deal with you? Tell me down in the comments. Um, you know, for, that's pretty uh, pretty expensive, man. $179.99 for a care package. You know, I understand they put a lot of detail, it looks like, in, in that uh, recon uh, drone. But, uh, you know, uh... Uh, as far as the, excuse me, the, the care package, uh, they did release a trailer announcing it, uh, today, I believe. Yeah, yeah, today, today. I uh, will put that in the description, so definitely go check that out. Uh, they tell you about the care package, you know, what's inside and all that stuff. And there's other exclusives that I probably didn't mention. There's a quick look at it. Um, but yeah, guys, that's about it, man. Nothing big, um. I don't know. I still haven't decided what to get. Obviously, like I said, I still haven't pre-ordered it. Um, I'm, you know, in my personal opinion, opinion, excuse me, I'm, I'm kind of getting tired of Call of Duty just, you know, because my Modern Warfare 3 experience, it wasn't good at all. And it still ain't good, but, you know, I still play it because uh, sometimes I want it to be good. It just fails me on, like, the first Black Ops for, for me at the time was the best. And it still kind of is, but just, you know, the hackers and all that. But anyways, um, yeah, man, I'm I'm definitely uh, excited for it because of what I've seen at GamesCon. Like I said, if you haven't checked out uh, that, uh, you know, review, <laughs> not review, if you haven't checked out my thoughts and info about it, I'll definitely leave a comment over there, bam. And, uh... Yeah, uh, that's about it, guys. Sorry for uh, wasting your time, maybe. But, yeah, just like I said, the third wave came out. Uh, you know, pre-order it now. It's, you know, win a chance to get a Xbox 360, XR drone avatar, Turtle Beaches, doop, uh, and uh, visit to Treyarch. That's for the th third wave and the uh, fourth wave coming October like I said, I ain't your number one source, but hopefully, you guys, uh, there's a team of Treyarch right there with the care package. Like I said, I will, um, you know, leave the trailer down below. Uh, so far, to my knowledge, uh, there's there's a, also includes weapon cameo, exclusive player card backgrounds, which is, I think, the wild card they're calling it now. 
Uh, what about here? I didn't believe I didn't leave it after now. Same thing. Um, what I see from the from this, unlike um, um, maybe Modern Warfare 3, they are like I said, they are um, making the you know fifty dollar uh, one year subscription to get the you know exclusive maps and all that crap. And I think a lot they're gonna put implement a lot into Black Ops 2 because you know the zombies and everything. But um. Yeah, they haven't really announced any of these uh, care package or uh, hardened edition, but uh, you probably have to pay that separately. But you know, new other news can come and it could be included. Like I said, man, uh, I'm gonna just bring you what they just announced. And um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Um, just getting back to my roots again, and uh, you know, be safe, stay positive, and uh, thumbs up for. Black Ops 2 news, and um, other than that, see you on the next one. Yeah!